The Fluid XPS Expert Personal Shopper Demo, powered by IBM Watson. It's an example of a Watson-powered application in the ecosystem. So, in e-commerce, it's a one and a quarter trillion dollar industry. And what we want to show is that for the 70% of parts that are abandoned, there's a better way to approach it through bringing the personal experience of a shopper into every online digital interaction. So this is an example of Fluid bringing the power of IBM Watson in a use case with the North Face. So in this example, let's say I'm gearing up for a trip. Well, I'd go to the North Face's website, and instead of dealing with the drop-down menu, search links, I'm going to open a conversation with Watson directly. In the conversation, I'm able to watch, ask Watson in natural language that I'm gearing up for a 14-day backpacking trip and I want to know what equipment to look for. Now, there's a lot going on in this question. I'm gearing up, it's a 14-day trip, and I need equipment for backpacking. There's a lot to consider and a lot of context to be taken into account. Well, Watson's well, going to take this question, run across product documents, uh, the journals and reviews and come back with a list of categories for me to consider. Well, I know I want to look at technical facts, so I'm going to ask Watson to show me that. In the same fashion, Watson continues the conversation by showing a list of different packs for me to consider. Now, at this point, I really don't know a lot about technical packs, and for me to leave the experience to go type into a search engine, go into a store, it makes it very problematic, and there's a chance I might not come back. So, what if instead I could ask directly what technical packs I need for Fitzroy Patagonia in the winter? So Watson's going to take that question and return based on where I'm going, when I'm going, and the temperature that's being considered there. In particular, Watson's recommending the Profit 65 pack with ABS technology. Now, I'm curious as to what ABS technology is, and if I were to go into a search engine and search, chances are I'd get analog brake systems. Well, if I were to ask Watson what ABS technology is in the context here, it's going to bring me to Avalanche airbag systems, which you'll see in a moment. And this really demonstrates how continuing conversation in context of the domain that I'm working in creates a fundamentally different experience. So I'm brought to a page to learn more about ABS technology, including other products and multimedia content that was tagged for that as well. Mm -hmm. So I'm able to do all the research around ABS technology that I'm looking at within one cohesive experience where I will remain engaged. So I'm able to do my research on ABS technology, but like most shoppers online, I want to know what other people think. I want to know about ratings and reviews for the product. Mm -hmm. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to ask Watson to show me how the product is rated. So I'll go back into the conversation and I'll ask Watson to see ratings. Now, this is all content that's been curated and he's going to respond with ratings and reviews as well as journals that it relate to the product as well. So I'm able to get a comprehensive view of how to consider the product. So I've done my research, I'm engaged, I've stayed within the experience. It's now time for me to check out. I know I want the Profit 65. I'm going to tell Watson to check out. And an interesting thing here is based on what we've been talking about, Watson's also re recommending additional products to consider for my trip. This is an example of bringing a very personal shopping experience into the hands of a digital consumer through the power of IBM Watson.